What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Happy New Year and with the new year I wanted to kick things off with a new build. I know we have the 110 going on right now Which is not a full build in my opinion. It's you know the pit bike uh, We have the 125 giveaway bike that we're gonna be building up here over the next few months And I wanted to do something for a personal bike like I did with the L and the 250 stroke straight rhythm being a 90s kid uh, It's pretty obvious that I was a huge Jeremy McGrath fan the uh, Factory Honda nostalgia. I don't know. There's just something about that that really always stuck out to me and I have wanted to recreate one of these for a little while so without further ado here's the new build it is a 1994 CR 250 this era of bike I don't know just it's just so like I said before nostalgic to me it's just something that's so cool has such a good memory embedded in my mind. Watch McGrath and their factory Honda boys rip around on these things and it was just such a dominant bike. Having said that, I don't really know what we're gonna do like to customize it. Um, there are some parts that could use some refreshing like the frame and stuff, you know, obviously it's almost a 30 year old bike so it's gonna have some pits here and there but this was a very clean find that I found actually on Facebook Marketplace of all places and a uh, super cool guy locally that sold it to me. Now when I look at pictures of these back in the day even the factory bikes there's a lot of silver going on so I don't really know what we're gonna do to customize it without taking away that kind of factory look. Maybe just uh, lace them up with some new wheels and put some red hubs just to kind of add a little bit of flair to them. A couple other custom parts here and there. I don't really want to take away that nostalgic feeling that this bike gives. Um, I want to do some retro graphics. I know the boys over at SKDA will be able to help me out. That last little bit, the graphics, you know, that kind of cherry on top to help this thing look like it did back in the day. If you guys have any opinions on this, let me know um, down in the comment section. I definitely read all of those and listen to you guys. So uh, yeah, give me your input. But like I said, I don't really want to take too much away from the old school look of this. I don't know, it was just an, just an era that was so cool to me um, when I was a kid. Just want to introduce this thing real quick. We'll start tearing it apart next week. Uh, I got to go to Anaheim 1, so hopefully I'll see some of you guys there. Um, but enjoy some clips of me ripping and singing around the neighborhood without uh, getting my neighbors too mad. 